Is America being hijacked by out-of-control courts? The shocking truth coming up next. We the people overruled. A shocking look at America's runaway judiciary. America was founded by those intent on escaping a tyrannical king. And yet today, a different kind of tyranny is threatening our land. I'm talking about out-of-control judges. You be the judge. The U.S. Supreme Court struck down Texas's sodomy law. Speaking of the homosexual plaintiffs in the case, I don't know how we're going to say that a biological brother and sister who are adults cannot engage in consensual incest. For example, the homosexual sodomy case and the constitutional right to homosexual sodomy. I mean, we fought a revolution to get free of bad European ideas. Homosexual sodomy is now a guaranteed constitutional right for all Americans. And local communities can no longer legislate biblical views on the subject, no matter how many people favor it. A constitutional right to own slaves. They recently discovered the right to homosexual sodomy, judicial activism. The culture war, judicial activism, praised by all the New York Times and the Washington Post and the NBC and CBS and ABC. Then the judges in effect rule us just as kings of old did. By the beat of an extremist agenda led by judges in black robe. This judge's wife is the head of the ACLU. But some judge all of a sudden out of the blue. Are we one nation under God? Not if activist judges have their way. Anti-Christian values, secular humanism, new ageism. School children could not wear red and green colored clothing to the winter break party. Sparkle season. Homosexual activists surrounded the Christians and even accosted them. Even portions of the Bible could be considered hate speech. And on and on it goes in increasingly secular America. For the purpose of promoting religion. It's awakened a sleeping giant. Slow motion coup d'etat. We have a court ordering essentially the murder of an innocent person. We need not be slaves to our out-of-control courts. And may God bless America.